Cameron Stone, a legendary actor. You have to say it like that. Legendary. 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 Um, it's, we made it for the 48 hour film challenge in Glasgow. It was straight away, it was like the top of our head. The minute we got a mockumentary, we said, uh, how about a, a failed actor? We'll make it about a failed one. But then uh, as we're walking away thinking about it, I was like, nah, that's, that seems a bit too cliche or it's been done before. How about a legendary actor? Actually, he's really successful, so we could play about with that a lot easier than a failed one. Uh, and then it just kind of came from there. Mm -hmm. we, we wrote it in what, an hour? An hour. Or this year it was, they had CDs. CDs. And you took the CD and you opened up the CD and it was like, mockumentary. Um, and we, like horror, horror drama, sci fi, time sci -fi. travel. Yeah, time travel. Silent, silent film, and like, like every genre you can think of. But everyone has to include in their f film, and they've got certain rules like a prop, uh, a character, and a oh, yeah, piece no, of dialogue. Yeah. And each year that the 48 hour challenge goes on, it's uh, a different thing. Stone. The dialogue was... Uh, it's our little secret. It's our little secret. <laughs> it, the character was Ray or Ramona Lewis, who had to be a captain. Captain Ray or Ramona. Um, and the prop was a map. Uh -huh. So well, that's what we did. And we love her. This is an actress called Nicola Wellburn. But even before we got what it was, we're like, no, Nicola is going to be whoever it is. It'll be Nicola and she, we'll make her fall in the game. Um, going to get into trouble. Uh, and it'll be, at least she'll get the line of dialogue and stuff. And we just, that's, that's what we did. And it was, she was hilarious as per usual. Um, there was, there was no costs, whatever. I mean, the rules in the 40 hour film has to be that everyone's a volunteer. So you can't, be spending copious amounts of money of it. Um, you can if you want, but like, it was a God, it was a day shoot, so mm -hmm. everyone chipped in. I think I bought food for everybody, yeah. and we all chipped pizza, in for yeah, pizza. For yeah, <laughs> um, so that's how we funded it. I'm sorry we don't have a more exciting answer. <laughs> <laughs> but it's just lots of people pretty much willing to do it, which is what's cool about the 48 film challenge is that you're giving people a goal and something to do, so people are like, it's just 48 hours. When you think about it, it's just 48 hours. Yeah. I could do that. Seven years. <laughs> seven years. Seven years. Wait, Phil. Don't get too bogged down in the paperwork side of it. It's very important, but go find someone who likes to do that and let them deal with the paperwork. Um, just go make a film and learn what you're good at and what you're not good at, and then learn from your mistakes and then make another film. Learn from those mistakes, make another film, and just set yourself bigger and bigger goals that are achievable to you mm -hmm. until one day you've been doing it for seven years and you're still not anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Back to being in there, being surrounded by good people who know what they're doing and they can yeah. be willing to help me out, which is what Fraser does as well for me. Delegation's a very good tool. Yep, and it's really getting the right people as in reliable. You can tell, like say, an audition or something like that, if someone gets in contact with you uh, and they take a while to reply, it's not really a good thing all the time. You want someone that's always there, prompt, enthusiastic is a great thing as well. So it's always good to be surround yourself with enthusiastic people. But also people that know what they're doing. Mm -hmm. Here's a slip. We actually kept it in the film, which you can see. Now, you listen here. I've scored 100. Oh, goals, yeah, I know. Wrong. Right, you little shit. You're a small man and you're not very good. I do this for a living. Now, behave yourself. Be ready to do stuff that you, you haven't already planned as well is another one that I'm learning as well. I've had ideas, I've said, let's do that, it's going to be my way. You can't do that, someone else will come in with an idea or that. Like, actually, that's pretty good. <laughs> be humble enough to go, yes, that's actually better than my idea. Don't let your own ego get on top of you either. If someone suggests something that's a really good idea. Why does he look at me every time he says that? <laughs> well, that um, pizza never arrived. Pizza never arrived on time. <laughs> People are improvising as well uh, during it. But yeah, but that was funny. And that was funny. And we, the improvising lines that we wrote out a script, but a lot of people made up a lot of stuff as well. well some no, of it we some did. of it. See, I, I kind of had a, it's like an hour of stuff. I, I had a or twelve minutes. I kind of had a weird moment because we got. By the time we'd got there and we'd all set up and everyone was going and we sat Mark down to do the opening bit, because we did shoot it as chronologically as we could, and we sat Mark down and Mark did his bit and he kind of flew through it and I was like, hmm. <laughs> and then then we sat down like Tam and he flew through it and then we sat down Nicola and she flew through it and I was like, shoot, this is going to be a two minute film. Mm. So I just, I looked to you and I said, what would, what would we do? And you're just like, let's just improv more stuff. 
and Jamie, who plays the narrator, and who also oh. is in the scene with you. I said, Jamie, just make stuff up. Just ask questions. Ask questions. Ask random stuff. So we sat everybody... We to answer in character. So we... At, so we Do sat... remember some of them? I remember all of them. So we, <laughs> we sat... We sat everyone back in and we just went for it again and we just came up with so, so much good stuff. Oh, that's that's good. Good. Now that... That technically kind of was a problem. We were going through the... A sort of Christian Bale rant thing was just sort of making fun of that and that's we improvised all that as well. Jamie, yeah. again, was very good at that. And yeah, that, that was, went on for ages, just me going, it's this guy right here! And we did that outside, and there's people looking outside their windows, the opening them the on the phone. Police car went by as well, whilst I'm going, it's this prick right here! This is what he's doing! la da 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 Oh, there's a cop car! <laughs> what are they, what are they? People have been commenting on Facebook and Twitter, saying how much they really enjoyed it, and <laughs> saying it was the best film of the night. <laughs> In summary. In summary. In summary, people have been laughing and saying good things about it. So.